Hey, Blender Bob here. Somebody asked me, how do you match the grain when you want to composite CG element on a live action plate? I would love to show it to you in Blender, but Blender doesn't have an add grain node, so I will show it to you in Natron instead. It's eight o'clock, I have time to do this before my day starts, so here we go. Okay, so if we take a look at the plate, we can see there's a grain, it's a little bit blurry, but on the render, there's also a grain, but it's sharper than the plate. So we need to blur our render to match a little bit the blur. Ideally, you would make a render that would be grainless so that you can add the grain just the amount you want without blurring your image too much. After that, you add the grain node and you start playing with the settings, you play with the sliders, move them left to right, red, green, blue intensity and all this stuff, but it's really hard to tell if it's matching or not. So how can you do it? Well, this is how you do it. You do the red, green and blue separately. Just like that, I do the red first. Well, it doesn't matter which order you do it, you do the red, you do the green, and then you do the blue. To see the red, green, and blue, you just need to press R, G, and B in the viewer. If you press one of these letters again, you will go back to the RGB result. And here we go, we just matched the green. ba da -dam. Bye! Three frogs are on a railroad. The first one says, watch out! What? 